Everything I touch dies. I used to live for other people. My family. Doing what they would want for me. My sister the cleric, my brother the warrior. My father, my mother, making uh, the crafted artisan goods. Armor and linen, mostly. And, uh... Because my contribution is not as tangible as killing someone, or healing someone, or creating something, it was considered not to be a worthy investment. But it is my release, friends. It is what I must do to make my heart sing. And even if people try to stop you, say poo poo to them. You must do what, what your passion is. Follow it to the very end. I think this is the only way to lead a truly fruitful and successful life. What is this city out on the water? Well, it is not the Imperial City, so... It might be safe to have a look. Hmm... I hope they are friendly to Gajits in this land. It could be quite unfortunate to be rejected, put out onto the street, told that I have to go to the Imperial City in order to resupply. Because as we both well know, friends, there's no way that that will be possible. At least while the Emperor's alive, but... Brian Dar's not going to be the one to waltz into the palace and see him die. Although, if I could lead a troll into the palace... <laughs> no, he has many armed guards. It would take a legion of trolls. Hmm. I suppose it will get figured, friends, sooner or later. Until that point, I just have to keep my head down. My goodness. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Randar does not like. Surely it would lead to my death. This is not a city at all. Or does it lead into a city? Some more foxglove. Hmm. I really should make my own potions. If we could sell them, I might be in the money once more. Bravo and Skingrad. Yes, I want to go to Bravo, please. Be very careful. This bridge was not in such disrepair before. Hmm. Quite curious. The Emperor has money to build a palace, but not enough to build a bridge. Hmm. Nothing changes. You know? The greedy will always seek power. And that is why Brandar enjoys laying low. Watching it happen, observing, taking notes. One day I might be able to strike back. But not yet, friends. I am not mighty. I am just a little kitty. Trying to make his way. Hmm. Well, friends, I do believe this is Bravo. And if I remember correctly, the entrance... Well, the land entrance is just over this way. Ah, my old stomping grounds. Quite beautiful in its own right. Simply not quite as lovely as elsewhere, but it will serve. I am consistently looking for a new place to call home. Hmm. 
Although, my rival does live here. Varen Vamori. Oh, friends, you should see him, the smug look on his face. Calls himself the wit of Bravel. <laughs> when Brandar comes into Bravel, I at least double, triple, quadruple the wit that is present. Hmm. It doesn't seem the guard recognized me. We might be in. Ah, even lovelier on the inside than on the outside, wouldn't you agree, friends? I just love this wood. It is like a giant world made of scratching post. Ah, little perches. How could you not enjoy? Oh, up, up! Aha! Kitty, 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 kitty. Just wedge myself right here? No, nope, not quite. Too much tail, you know. Baby got back. Hmm. The chapel. I don't remember ever going in there. Where are my friends? Has everyone moved away in my short time? But. Oh, good day to you, Argonian. Do you know of any rumors? Thrillus has a way with words. I wish he could teach me how to speak that well. It sounds like you speak okay to me, Argonian. Seeing you. Yes, be well. Hmm. Oh, oh, guard, guard, guard. I'll just casually walk kind of swiftly over this way. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ah, let us have a bit more of a look around. I do wonder. I don't want to come across Baron Vamori. I have no time for your pathetic attempts at small talk. Now walk away before I get nasty. You see, this is the reasons that I don't like the Dunmer so much. What is it now? Hmm. What's going on with Hello, yes, Scriva. Scriva gives you greeting. Luxury imports, exports are Scriva's fair game. And your hair does look so lovely. Perhaps you could tell me a bit more I don't about trust Bravo. You enough to talk about that. Surely you recognize my face. We're all talking about the Emperor's murder. We Emperor's no murder? And no heir. That's never happened before. I suppose we should all be worried. What? How, how was the Emperor murdered? What can you tell me, please? Oh my god. I've been slinking that. around for no reason we're whatsoever. We're not talking about the Emperor's murder. What? We have no Emperor. I hate what? This is... This is shocking news, friends. What? He's dead? Is this also Brandar's fault? Everything I touch dies. <sighs> I'm not sure what to think, friends. I, I continuously try to do the right thing, you know? How often does it turn out? I'm... Quite downtrodden. While it comes as a, a relief to my heart, I can't help but feel that Brandar is in part responsible for... For the death of the Emperor. I was petitioned to be his bodyguard. I abdicated my duties. Ah. <sighs> What am I to do, friends? It is only the afternoon, and yet I feel like sleeping the day away. Trying to forget about... This news. This news that should come... And brighten my day, but instead has... 
crushed me. Almost immediately. <sighs> I can only wonder what Caius Cassades would have to say. Well, the Temple of Mara. Perhaps I can find one of the divines. RK. You know, you are a cat, actually. Arthe. Debella, goddess of love. Oh, I need some love. Stendar, my friend. Please grant me mercy. The wayside of Stendar, and henceforth receive a blessing at Stendar's holy altars. So this is not his church. Hmm. But still, I pray to you, Srendar. Tell me that I am not responsible for the Emperor's murder. Give me a sign that this is the way that things were, were meant to be. <sighs> I don't know what to do, friends. I just don't know what to do. I suppose we pick up, we carry on. But how do you continue carrying on when you know that everything you touch comes apart? I shall pray on it, friends. I shall think further. I hope you shall join me for the next time. And I hope I shall be in a better mood. Until then, friends, goodbye.